Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and today's video is going to be a skincare video. I recently received this package in the mail and this is from Sano Naturals. They did reach out to me because they are launching um, their K2 Slay box and they asked if I'd be interested in reviewing their products, specifically their mask. I'm not so sure when they started their company, but I do know that all of their products are produced in the U.S. I also saw on their website that they use naturally derived organic ingredients as much as possible. And it also says there that they're 100% vegan and cruelty-free. So those should tick off some of the items that you're looking for a brand or a company or the products that you're using. I know that there are a lot of us who are very particular with those. So those are really some good stuff. Now let's talk about the products that I received. As mentioned, I received this in the mail I think last week but I wasn't able to film a video because we were preparing for a road trip. We went on a Texas road trip and so I didn't really have the time to film a video but I did test this out already. I used it once. I received two facial masks. It says here facial pack for anti-aging, whitening, and removing wrinkles. Um, I was talking to, to Abby from the company and she did mention that whitening here means more of like brightening, not really whitening. Does that make sense? I hope that makes sense. So as you can see, I have already used up this pack. So we are going to use this one today. So that's how the mask looks like. I don't know if you guys can see that, but it's just a really clear gel mask. One of the things that I love about this mask is it's not over sticky like other gel masks. It just feels like I applied some sanitizer on. And they also included a mask applicator. Along with the mask and the applicator, I received the ingredient list. I also got the instructions card. And it says here, you just need to wash your face and dry completely. Apply a thin layer of the Sino Silk Mask. Leave the mask on for 10 to 15 minutes. Do not exceed 20 minutes. Anyways, this mask claims to brighten your skin, uh, reduce the appearance of your pores, and make your skin look glowy. We need that. I want to glow. Anyway, so this is the barest you'll ever see me. I just washed my face and I pat it dry with a clean towel. I don't know if you guys can see it, but I have dry patches everywhere. It's just super dry. Unbelievably dry. That has always been my issue even when I was in the Philippines. Despite that humid weather, my, my cheeks area um, and my mouth area can still be very dry. And since it's dry, my face can look really dull and flat and lifeless so i really hope that this mask can help me add a little bit of natural glow on my face if it can remove the dry patches even better all right so after my 1000 year long introduction let's go ahead and get started with the actual demo of the mask okay so there's my five head <laughs> one of the things that i've learned when i try this mask for the very first time is you want to make sure that you apply just enough product i did it wrong the first time i used this product i used up the entire thing that's because i thought one pack is good for one use uh, since they're individually packed but a little goes a long way so you don't really need a lot i think one pack for me is good for two sessions or it could be three depending on how much product you apply on your face and the mask looked a little weird when it started to dry out i'm gonna insert a clip here of a selfie that i took with the mask starting to dry it's just so weird i can't even explain it i think it's because i applied too much mask on my face that's why it looked like that but we are gonna find out today if that is the actual reason why it looked like that or it just looks like that when it dries out all right so this is how my face look like i'm gonna take a quick selfie under natural lighting and i'm gonna quickly insert it here so we can all check if there's really a difference on my skin after using this mask since i don't like wasting products i'm gonna use the mask here apply it on my face One thing I want to point out, guys, this mask smells very herbally. 
So if you don't like scents like that, this may not be the perfect mask for you. It's already 3.55 in the afternoon and I'm done with applying the mask on my face and this is how it looks like. And it's, I do want to share with you guys that the moment you apply the mask, you will feel a certain tingling sensation. It's not painful, but I can definitely feel the mask working. It's already 4 o'clock in the afternoon and this is how the mask looks like after 5 minutes. If you notice, it's starting to dry here. My face feels so tight right now that it's kind of hard to talk. I'm just going to chill here for a few more minutes and I will be right back once the mask is completely dry or before I rinse it off. Hey guys, I'm back and it's already 4.12 in the afternoon so it's been about 17 minutes since I applied this on my face. I just want to quickly show you guys how it looks like when it's completely dry. And yeah, this is how it looks like. It's not as weird as it looked like the first time I used it, but it still looks a little weird. It's probably just how it's designed to look like when it's completely dry and I'm, I'm totally okay with that. My face is super duper tight. So I'm just gonna go ahead and, and rinse it off and I'll be right back for my thoughts about this product. Hey guys, I'm back and it's already 4.19 in the afternoon. It took me about two minutes to rinse off all the mask on my face but this is how my skin looks after I wash it off and pat it dry with my towel right off the bat guys I'm telling you my skin feels insanely tight I have no idea what's in this mask but this is the tightest that my skin has ever been my cheeks still feel a little dry but it's not as dry as earlier I don't know about you guys but I think my skin looks a little brighter than earlier and I think it's glowing too. I don't know if it's because of my lighting, but let me take a quick selfie under natural lighting so I can show you guys how it looks like under natural lighting. And you guys tell me if my skin looks glowing after I use this face mask. Oh yeah, I strongly recommend you guys try out this mask. This mask gets two huge thumbs up from me. I believe this mask and the applicator cost $24.95, around $25. But since you are a member of this family, Sano Naturals is celebrating our family or friendship by giving you guys a discount. When you purchase this mask, just check the info box below and all the details should be down there. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you want to see more videos like this, give this video a thumbs up or leave me a comment down below. So that's it for today, guys. As always, I appreciate your love and support. Thank you guys for watching this video and I'll see you in my next one. Bye!